Here we have a 2018 BMW 440i M Sport, finished in a Snapper Rocks blue metallic exterior paintwork which really does look fantastic from every angle. We've then got a full carbon M performance kit as you can see just here we've got the carbon kidney grills, we've then got the carbon front splitter just there, we've then got our alloy wheels just here all four in excellent condition, these are 19 inches We've then got the black accent, we've got the carbon side skirt, side to side, just there. Color-coded wing mirrors and door handles, as well as shark fin antenna. We've then got the black trim around the window with the privacy glass for the rear passengers. There's a look at that second alloy wheel. Now as we come to the rear, we have got a carbon spoiler, just there, as you can see. We've then got the carbon diffuser down at the bottom with the dual exit exhaust. We've then got front and rear parking sensors as well as a reversing camera. We've got a great amount of boot space in here as well. As you can see just there, plenty of space in there for whatever you may need. And as you can also see the vehicle is free from any major marks, dents or scratches. Now if we go on to the interior, start at the back. We've got the full leather throughout. We've got the integrated speakers on the left, well on both sides just there. We've got the ISO fixed points within these seats as well. This is actually a night blue Dakota leather to be specific. Close that up. In the front here we've got that same full night blue Dakota leather. We've got the electrically adjustable seat controls just down there. Both sides have got the electrical adjustment options. On the door here we've got our uprated Harman Kardon sound system. We've got this lovely trim just here electric power folding wing mirrors with electric window control and additional storage. We've then got some more of that Dakota leather on the doors. Blue accents throughout as well, as you can see, follows around the whole car. Now we'll start the vehicle up, foot on the brake. There we go. Now, as you can see, we are free from any warning lights on the dashboard and the vehicle itself is covered just over 25,400 miles. We've then got our multifunctional steering wheel with things like speed limiter, cruise control. We've got phone controls and volume controls as well. We've got our paddle shifters just behind for taking manual control of the gears. On the right here, we've got our auto lights, got auto wiper stalk just there. And on the left, we've got our auto high beam assist. Now in the middle here, we've got our infotainment screen. So on here, you'll find things like navigation. We've then got different forms of media connectivity. On here you'll find things like DAB and FM radio, CD slash DVD, Bluetooth or USB. We've then got phone connectivity so we can connect our phone via Bluetooth to make calls or listen to music. We've then got different driving modes. We've got things like Eco Pro, Comfort, Sport and Sport Plus. So you can suit which one of these best suits your driving style at the time. I'll go back into Eco there. Now if I put the vehicle into reverse, just like so. We have got a visual display of both front and rear sensors on the left and our reversing camera on the right there as well. Back into park. Now moving our way down we've got our stereo controls next with traffic alerts on the left. We've then got our dual zone climate control so we can control each side of the vehicle's temperature independently. Both front passengers are treated to heated seats which work perfectly as you would imagine just there. We've then got air conditioning as well. Down below we've got some additional storage space, two good sized cup holders with 12 volt connectivity. We've got a key in there at the moment. We've then got our traction control button, dynamic mode select, a button to turn off or on our parking sensors, and of course our gear stick just here. So I'm sure most of you are familiar with these, but we've got park, reverse, neutral, drive, and then if we flick across to the left, We've, we go into sport mode and then we can actually engage manual mode like so and go down or up a gear like that as well. So you've got the choice of using the paddles or the gear stick, whichever you prefer. We've then got our control wheel just here with touch pads for controlling the infotainment screen just there. Very easy to use and navigate once you've had a play around with this. We've then got our soft touch leather armrest which also doubles up as storage. Now the vehicle is ready to drive away today with free next day nationwide contactless delivery, competitive low finance, fresh service, fresh MOT, and it's also HBI clear. That's all from me on this video. Thank you for watching. Video test drive for this BMW 440i M Sport. Now the purpose of this video today is to show you that the car drives exactly how you would expect it to. For example now, I'm not having to wrestle with the steering wheel to keep the vehicle in a straight line. 
I'll also go through some of the vehicle's features and demonstrate that they work exactly how they should as well. So we do have both speed limiter and cruise control. So cruise control specifically, to activate this, I simply press cruise, press up, and I'm now cruising at 47 miles an hour. Very easy to adjust this, like so as well. To deactivate, I can either press cruise or apply pressure to the brake. We've then got our gear changes, so I'm currently in sixth gear. Down to fifth, down to fourth, fifth, sixth, seventh, and eighth. And as you can tell, through those gear changes, completely seamless transitions, no jerky motions at all, or any unwanted sounds. Exactly how you would expect. Now we are slowly approaching the roundabout now, where we're taking a left turn, as if you were here with today. And it's a good point to talk about the performance of this vehicle. You've got a great amount of power in here. You've got around 322 horsepower, which will reach you 0 to 60 in around five seconds. So seriously fast. As you can see so i've just put it back into auto by flicking across and back so yeah 322 horsepower not 60 in five seconds you're certainly not going to have any trouble overtaking with specs like that also incredibly comfortable and conserved in the cab here we've got our premium operated harman kardon sound system electrically adjustable memory seats for the driver we've then got our all of our modern features on the infotainment screen as well really nice to place to be in here now here at rs car sales we have been doing deliveries for the last three to four years as well as three next day nationwide deliveries for the last year and a half as well so although the covid19 situation has had a huge impact on many businesses and still is doing to this day we feel like we're quite well prepared we have adjusted our deliveries ever so slightly to make them contactless and what this means is we'll sanitise our hands, we'll sanitise the keys and we'll just do an extra thorough clean of the vehicle before delivering it to yourself just to ensure your safety and our own. Now we are a 5 star dealership as well, if you look at mine we've got over 300 5 star reviews on Google and Auto Trader alone as well as many others on other sites like Car Gurus. so if you go online check these reviews out you'll see that our customers really do reiterate the fact that we are a dealership that cares we really do want you to have such a pleasant buying experience from ourselves that you would recommend us to your friends, to your family and even come back to us when the time is due for your next vehicle purchase. Now I'm about to take a right turn into the industrial park where I'll perform an emergency brake and also demonstrate the reverse width how it should. So three, two, one. Very sharp on the brakes just there, straight into reverse. We've got a visual display of both front and rear sensors as well as our reversing camera all working exactly how it should. Now, this is usually where you'd be extremely happy with the vehicle. You'd want to come inside, see what kind of deal you could work out. Obviously, you're not here at the moment. However, do feel free to get in touch. Book an appointment if you wish to view the vehicle in person. If there is anything we have missed, then have the online photos, the video walk around, or the test drive. Again, feel free to get in touch. One of the team would be more than happy to help you out. Part exchanges are welcome, just let us know the make, model and condition of the vehicle you're wishing to part exchange. And that's all from me on this video. I hope you found this useful and we'll hopefully hear from you soon. Cheers.